Hi, welcome to Lynn's Recipes. Today I'm going to make egg baguette bake. This would be really good for breakfast, you could have it for a brunch, or you could even have it for dinner with a little side salad. The amounts of the ingredients that you're going to need to make this recipe will be listed in the information box below. You can find it on my website or my Roku channel. Also in the information box below, please check out my social media links. The ingredients are, you'll need two baguettes, some Italian sausage, and if it's in the link, you'll need to remove it from the casings, some red bell pepper, or you could use yellow that you've chopped, chopped scallions, You'll need some snipped basil, eggs, cream. You'll need some fontina or mozzarella cheese. I've got fontina and it's shredded. And you'll need some salt. You'll also need to preheat your oven to 350 degrees. The first thing you're going to want to do is take your baguettes and put them on a parchment lined baking sheet. You're going to want to make a little wedge in the center about an, leaving about an inch on the sides and the ends and you're going to want to remove the inside um, and make a little well and that's where we're going to pour the eggs. After you've done that you'll want to set that aside. I'm going to start by putting my sausage in the skillet and start breaking it up. And I'm also going to add the red peppers cook these together for about eight minutes until the sausage is done. My sausage is almost done so for about the last minute or so I'm going to add these scallions or green onions that I've sliced and I'm going to stir them in and cook them along with the sausage and the red peppers. My sausage is done so I'm going to turn this off and now I'm going to set this aside and move on to the next step. So now what I'm going to do is take my eggs and break them into this bowl. I have 10 of them here. And here's the last one. I'm going to add my whipping cream. The basil. Teaspoon of salt. And I'm just going to mix this all together until the eggs are all broken up and it's all incorporated. I'm also going to add a cup of the cheese into the egg mixture. And just continue mixing this together. That looks good. Get all my basil off of my whisk. Now, if you had a lot of grease on your sausage, you would want to drain that. I didn't. Mine was pretty lean, so I didn't drain mine. Okay, that looks good. That's fine. So what I'm going to do now is add my sausage mixture into the eggs and the cream. I'm just going to give this a stir to mix it all together. That looks good. So now I'm ready to pour this into the bread. Okay, so I have my bread here and I've taken the insides out and made kind of little bread boats. So now what I'm going to do is pour half in each. Just divide it the best you can. And I have this other, excuse me, half of a cup of the uh, shredded cheese. I'm just going to sprinkle that on top. Divide it amongst the two bread boats. And now I'm ready to bake it. I'm going to put it in the preheated 350 degree oven for 25 to 30 minutes until the eggs are set. I just took my bag outs out of the oven. It actually took about 40 minutes for the eggs to set up instead of like the 25 I told you before. So I also wanted to mention to you that you could change this up a lot. You could use a different cheese, you could put spinach, you could use mushrooms, just about anything that is to your taste you could use in this recipe. What I'm gonna do now is let this sit here for about five minutes before we start slicing them up and serving them. 
This is set on the tray for about five minutes and now I'm ready to slice some and put it on a serving plate for you. So I've got a serrated knife here. I'm just going to start slicing through it. I'm going to do the middle pieces here. I finished putting this on a plate to show you. So this is Egg Baguette Bake. I hope you enjoy it.